Divine Blessing. Holy water from Goddess Guinevere fully restores HP and undo irregularities. So, in typical Dark Souls fashion, very, very cryptic, very, very cryptic indeed. Welcome back, subscribers. So, that item description was about as clear as swamp water. Therefore, we love experiments, so we're going to have to do an experiment. This is going to be Divine Blessings versus everything. So, that means we need to test Poison, Toxic, Curse, Bleed, and you know those guys down in New London Ruins, those blob monsters that are always trying to poke you with their stick and cover you with that translucent goo that they have? And then your health bar starts ticking down. Well, those guys as well. I don't really know what that's called, probably no one does. So we're going to test that as well. Let's get to it. As we're already here in Blight Town, let's start with the first one, Poison. Okay, I'm going to be really surprised if this one does not work. Let's do it. Way success. Folks, test number two. Let's get toxic. Come on, little buddy. Do your thing. Way. Okay, so I'm going to be really surprised if this does not work. Let's go for it. Way, superb. So, success. Success for Toxic. Okay, number three on the list is Curse. Now, I don't think this one is really going to work, but let's face it, we need to test it anyway. Okay, here goes. Okay, that did not work. Does Remedy work? Nope, Remedy does not work. Purging Stone. There we go. So that's the only way to cure Curse. As a little bonus, let's do the Curse Resist spell. Lovely, that works a treat. Okay, next, let's try bleed. Alright, let's test it. Way, absolute success. I actually wasn't expecting that one to work so well. Let's try it with the remedy spell as well. And the Remedy spell gets rid of it as well. That's good to know. And now for the moment we have all been waiting for. I'm going to give the Blob Monster in here the permission and the consent to splash me with his translucent goo so we can find out if we can cure it with a Divine Blessing. Hey, okay, that's taking effect. You can see I'm moving slowly, but can I cure it? No, it does not cure it. Well, folks, that sludge monster was a bit of a surprise. I actually thought that would work, if I'm honest with you, but it didn't. But that's why we do these experiments in the first place, because if we don't try, we don't know, right? So it's been about a month since I last uploaded a video. I've been a bit busy with different things, but anyway, if you guys keep watching, keep subscribing, then I will keep making them. From now until Elden Ring and beyond. Ciao for now, folks. We'll see you in the next video.